That's as much love as this big machine's gonna get from us. Oh, right. Oh, right. I can see what's going on here. Yeah, yeah. Even this has got mud on it. <clears throat> the Top Gear producers believe that big machines need love too. Fair. Yeah. So today, you and Joe must clean this Caterpillar 307 excavator crawler. It weighs eight tonnes, has a four-cylinder, four-stroke diesel, naturally aspirated engine. Good God, the pressure washer's got more beans. Kicking out a whopping 53 horsepower. Big numbers. You have eight hours starting now. Let's be honest, if any machine has the divine right to be muddy... It's a dig. It's the one that picks up the dirt. Yeah, absolutely. This is it. Let's have a look at it. Look at the absolute state of it. Looks like it's been digging up a swamp. Yeah, I'll make you right. Well, it's been on its side, one of the two. Should we have a look at the tracks? Yeah. Oh, much the same. I'm worried about the cab, though. That's making me itch. It's going to be fine. The doors are closed. It's not going to be muddy in there. I'm not quite as optimistic as you. Let me prove you wrong. Jesus! Oh, wow. It's not good. This is going to be graft. Mm. We need to start on this exterior. Still love that noise. That's fine. Yeah, it? like it never gets boring. No. And watching it work. And the higher it is, the more satisfying <laughs> it is. The louder the clock. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> love a loud clock. <laughs> Look at the state of you. I feel it on my face. Oh my God, I didn't even realise it was this bad. You hit the mud and then you have to do two steps right and then two steps left and then it all just kicks back at you. It's a start, but we're going to have to get some more snow foam on this. Absolutely right. Agitate it with a brush and see where we are. Sounds good. You're about to work over the top of me, so I'm, I have full faith in you that you're not going to soak me, all right? Oh, no, I promise. Good man. Cheers, Jack. Can always trust you. <laughs> Jack, that same duty of care, was that not applied to you? 
来来来来来。来来来来穿你靴子。哦 ，Jack， what are you doing？ <笑> oh， come on。I think that's as much as we can do on the exterior. I think so. The the thing that's getting in my brain is we've taken all of this mud and dumped it on the floor. Yeah, we haven't cleaned the digger, we've just dirtied the floor. Can I get a little bit of time just to clean the floor off before we start on the cab? You can do it as long as I've sat down, I couldn't care less. Perfect. <laughs> Now, I think we're only going to get one of us in there. And as I'm the smallest, I've drawn the short straw. I'm going to start, as always, I'm going to pull out any rubbish that's stuffed in the corners behind the seats and then just get stuck into it and see what happens. Double. Digger and a digger. Digger and a digger. <laughs> so, start off with the seat being fabric, good amount of interior cleaner, a scrubbing brush, and hopefully it's going to come back a bit cleaner than what it was. Now, I have to say, with just a brush, a microfiber, this seat's come up a lot cleaner than I thought it was going to. Joe, Jack, I'm done with this mat. You jump out, made a lovely job in there. I'll do the outside glass. Sounds good to me. Jack, that's it. Time's up. Well, it definitely looks better than it did this morning. Mm, the same can't be said for you, my friend. <laughs> yeah, I'll make you right. I'll make you right. It's a shame we can't do much about the rust, but it is what it is. Yeah, I have to say, it's not what we normally do, but it's enjoyable doing something different. For sure. Blowing the mud from the tracks was my favourite part, but on the flip side to that, moving it inside, then moving it outside, then yeah. moving it inside. Yeah. 
Credit where credit's due, that seat, incredible. Well done. Yeah, I was really satisfied by the seat. That's probably the enjoyable bit for me. That's as much love as this big machine's gonna get. Mm. I hope the producers are happy. Yep. Let's call it a day.